So what are the options for denture wearers with dental, dental implants? Okay, so options for somebody already wearing a denture. Some people wear a full denture. Some people wear what we call a partial denture. Um, let's start with partial dentures. If you're wearing a partial denture and you don't have teeth in the back for the partial denture to rest on, mm -hmm. then most people find their partial denture, even though it, it hugs onto the, the teeth that are there, it kind of gets floppy in the back. And so a lot of times we'll put a dental implant on each side in the back, and that's like having a tooth back there now. Okay. And so their partial can snap into the implants, and all of a sudden, no more floppy. It's nice. Nice. Uh, a lot of times we can do that with a partial, not, not make a new partial. Sometimes we might have to make a new partial, uh, and so we just have to see. So then uh, there's other patients who don't have a partial denture. They have a full denture, all their teeth. Uh, a lot of people don't like their lower denture in particular, so their options are they can have two implants placed right up here towards the front, snap their denture. We, we can a lot of times use the denture they already have. They snap it in, snap it out. Suddenly, life is good. They, okay. they, their, their bottom denture is about as stable as their top denture, and so it's not a problem anymore to eat, bite, chew. Um, option number two, we, we fully support that bottom with four implants. We put two towards the front, two towards the back. Now there's no way that that denture is even compressing their gums and hurting, and so they've got full biting power again. Just like when they had their teeth, they can chew and not feel like, Ooh, I'm squeezing my gums. Okay. Uh, stays in place. I, I can't tell you how many patients have come into my office and say, I am so tired of wearing cream on the inside of my denture. I, mm -hmm. I don't like the, the whatever they're using, the, they, the, the yeah. goop, yeah, the adhesive. I mean, they, they're, they're just sick of it. Um, we put some implants underneath there and suddenly they never buy the adhesive again. It's awesome. Um, third option is they decide, you know what, I, I'm, I'm sick of wearing dentures all together. I want teeth that are locked into place and permanent. We put four or six implants. We put teeth that are permanently fixed onto those implants they don't take their teeth in and out anymore. They wear their teeth just like a regular person. You wouldn't be able to tell if they're wearing teeth that aren't their natural teeth. They can't hardly tell because they chew and they bite just like natural teeth. Uh, for a top denture, one of the biggest complaints that most people have is the roof of their mouth is covered. Their tongue doesn't like it, the way they speak, you know, they, they feel like there's this big thick thing. They can't taste stuff as good as they once did. Uh, and so we can actually cut the roof of the mouth out of their denture. Mm -hmm. We put four implants up on the top, they snap it in, and it stays just as if it was suctioned onto the roof of their mouth, only voila, their, their, their tongue can feel the roof of their mouth again, they can taste stuff. Uh, or somebody's wearing a top denture and they're, again, they're sick of wearing dentures, and so we put six implants up on the top, we make some permanent teeth that are just attached to the implants, doesn't come in and out anymore. It's, it's like teeth. 